Hey everyone, and welcome back to a brand new video. So, I know it's been a while since I uploaded onto YouTube, and I do apologise for my absence over the past five to six weeks. I kind of did have like a teeny tiny little mental breakdown, and I just wasn't ready to be putting content out there on Instagram and also YouTube that I just wasn't happy with, and that I kind of wasn't emotionally stable to do. I know you'll understand why I've had to take a little break, but I'm back now, and I'm really excited just to sort of yeah have a new approach to skincare and filming videos and just having them really fun and easy to watch so yeah over the past five or six weeks i've kind of really gathered a shit ton of skincare that i've either purchased myself or i've received in pr so i thought it'd be really nice to sort of come back um, and just do a really really nice chilled out relaxed video of new in skincare launches so we've got like the selfless by hiring products we've got new zit sticker products we've got new new Beauty of Yozen, new Dr. Serico, and also I've got some really good fan favourite products in here as well. So yeah, I'm really, really excited to show you what has been building up on my skincare room floor. And so first up, we'll actually go in with Selfless by Hiram. So this launched on either the 23rd or the 24th of June. It's the first week of July now, so not too long ago. But yes, I actually purchased the whole entire range on launch day. I was so, so excited about it. And I actually purchased the whole range because um, I kind of wasn't too sure which I wanted to buy and I actually wanted to really sort of test them out for you as well. I've actually not like opened this before and also I haven't tried any of the products out so I'm not going to do a sort of like a first impressions review video or anything like that because I feel like that has been done already now like James Welsh, Dr. Dre, Cassandra Banks and um, people like that but um, I might do like an updated two month review or something like that or sort of my favourites my least favourites. This colour palette is a bit of me, I'm not gonna lie. And so yeah we've got the Centella and Green Tea Daily Gel Cleanser which looks incredible. I know Rob from Man About Skin absolutely loves this cleanser. And then we've got the Niacinamide and Maracuja Daily Barrier Support Moisturiser which I feel like that is probably going to be my favourite one. We also have the Salicylic Acid and Sea Kelp Serum, the Retinol and Rainbow Algae Serum and also the Mandela acid and rice bran serum as well. I know there's a bit of controversy regarding the price points because people are expecting like ink list prices where they don't go above $14.99. However, you really do have to sort of think about the formulations and sort of the end goal of this brand as well. Like it costs, it costs more to be more sustainable and more environmentally friendly. Um, unfortunately so. And then next we have the new Zit Sticker Sunscreen Serum Launch. So I heard about this over on Instagram, I was just scrolling through and I was like, oh, this is a bit of me. But yeah, I am a big fan of Zit Sticker. I was sent um, their Hyperfade and their Oh, which one's the other one? I can't remember the other one now, but I was sent two of their sort of like spot patches, kind of like um, things. I don't know what they're called, micro dark patches, but what are they? But yeah, so this is their Mega Shade Sunscreen Serum, and this just looks absolutely to die for. It looks incredible. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited to get this on my face once I sort of empty some more sunscreen products out. It's UVA and UVB broad spectrum SPF 50. However, I don't think it would be water resistant or sweat resistant because I don't think it's designed to be like that. It's designed just to be really sort of fluid and very invisible on the skin. And then we have a couple of picks from Ciores. So you know me, I absolutely love Ciores as a brand. They're probably one of my favourite Korean skincare brands out there. They're just really sort of, yeah, they invest in their products and their formulations and their products are just so, so good. So I've got the My First Essener, which is um, kind of like a essence slash serum, kind of a very watery moisturizer in one. And then I've also got Bring the Light Serum as well. So yeah, I picked those up from Style Varna. I did have a few sort of like points, a few like credit kind of thing. So yeah, I picked them up. <laughs> and then following on with the theme of Style Varna, I do have a whole bunch of Cosrx products here, which... I have a 
whole bunch of Cosrx products which were very kindly gifted to me by Style Varner. I do have a discount code for them which kind of gives you 10 to 10% 10 off a certain amount and then it goes up to 15% after another certain amount. I'll leave all the details linked in the description box down below anyway but yeah um, that code is long standing and just enjoy it because you get a really good saving. So they gave me the Advanced Snail 92 All-in-One Cream which I kind of maybe have been using a couple of times now and I absolutely am obsessed. And we've got the BHA Blackhead Power Liquid which I think will be really good for like the mask knee problems um, and sort of like the congestion on the nose and also around the mouth. We've got the Advanced Snail Peptide Eye Cream which is going to be really really good just to you know um, kind of eradicate the fine lines and the wrinkles around the eye area whilst also not being far like far too occlusive. We also have the Propolis Light Ampoule which I've heard so so many great things about so yeah really excited to try that out and also finally the Centella Water Alcohol Free Toner. You know I'm one of those people that is just obsessed with facial mists and essences and toners before I apply like a really sort of like a humectant on my skin. Um, so yeah really really kind of like I need all of them because I go through them like there's no tomorrow. And then next we have two new products from Groom. So I was actually, when I did a review video of this brand, I called them Grum. Um, but it's actually Groom. Yes, I do stand corrected. Thank you. <laughs> they actually recently released um, a whole bunch of facial oils. Well, yeah, facial oils, body oils, whatever you like to sort of kind of use them for. Um, but I picked up two of them. So I picked up the hazelnut oil, which is really good at controlling sort of excess sebum production. So really great for your oily and your, co uh, and your combination skin. So I picked that up. I haven't opened it yet, but um, yeah, really, really excited to try that one out. And then I also picked up the prickly pear oil because I was just like, I've heard about this ingredient and how good it can be. It's sort of like rejuvenating the skin, sort of like firming the elasticity on the skin um, and also prickly pear. Like that is just a name that I can get on board with. <laughs> and then I was watching a James Walsh video and he featured the Hello Sunday sunscreen serum and I was like, uh, I need that. And then I went on to Call Beauty and he was out of stock and I thought, oh, great. So I, you know, joined the wait list and as soon as that I got that email to say it was back in stock, I was like, tick, 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 I am purchasing that. And I did kind of purchase a bit more as well. So I purchased the Hello Sunday, the one that's a serum, SPF 45 serum, which, oh. I also purchased their primer as well. So this is the SPF 50 primer. Um, not that I sort of wear makeup or anything like that. Um, but yeah, it's I, I was intrigued by it, so I picked it, picked it up. And then also, when I was on Cold Beauty, I did get the Josh Rosebrook Hydrating Accelerator. I saw a Instagram friend talk about this um, and just sort of rave about how it's so complimentary for other hydrating ingredients in your skincare routine um, and just elevates your whole product. So I picked it up and I'm really excited to try it because again, you know I love a facial mist. And then I actually got sent the new Dermasica 20% as Lake Acid Cream. So this, um, when it launched, I was a bit dubious about it. I was thinking, is this just another product that is, you know, high active ingredient that kind of just isn't necessary. But James Welsh, again, has also really raved about this product and I've seen a lot of really good reviews about this. So um, I'm gonna give it a try and see how it works with my hyperpigmentations, my redness that I can get, especially if I've reacted to a certain product. Um, and yeah, we'll just see how we get on with this. And I'm really intrigued to yeah, see how it kind of works for my skin. And then I've actually been sent a few products from Peace Out. So um, again, another brand that specializes in those like micro dark patches for spots. Um, but they have like a serum, they have um, a cleansing balm or something like that. Um, and yeah, a brand that I've really seen a lot of fantastic reviews about and just, I love the packaging. I love, love the packaging. So I picked up, well, I asked for, well, no, yeah, I asked for, they gave me, um, the retinol eye stick, which, again, I really hope um, gets rid of my 
lines that I've developed from having a mental breakdown and also some dark spots because one of my issues is hyperpigmentation and then also I got the acne serum as well because I've got acne prone skin. So yeah, I'll definitely let you know how that goes on there. But yeah, thank you to Peace Out for sending me a bunch of your products. I'm super, super excited. And then, shall I let you into a little secret? Okay, okay, I'll let you into a little secret. So on Instagram, I entered into a giveaway because there was a brand on there that I was absolutely dying to try out, but I just was like, oh, you know when you like really want a product, but you just don't know if you wanna wanna spend that much money on it, but I don't know. It was just something that I was kind of like putting off, but I was eventually gonna buy them. Anyway, I entered in a giveaway to win the whole entire collection, and guess who won? I did. So the brand is called EV Technology, and they specialize in sunscreen mousses. Yes, you hit that right, sunscreen mousses. And I've been trying out a few of their products, so um, a few of them have been, Open, um, open from their packaging. And honestly, these sunscreen products are game changing. They are absolutely incredible. And they are, are more on the pricey side of things, probably around the 20 to 30 pound mark. But I kid you not, they are absolutely incredible. And they are offer fantastic, fantastic um, sun protection as well. I've got a few more to sort of like unpackage in the plastic packaging, but yeah, really, really, really happy about that. Daily repair mousse, so that's like your hands and your body. Um, I've got like a SPF 30, like a kid's SPF 30, all sorts in there. <laughs> and then also Indeed Labs have sent over a few products for me to try out. And um, I, again, absolutely love Indeed Labs. I've got so, so many of their products. Some of my favorites are the Hydrolora Moisture Jelly, the Inceramide mask, night mask, and the retinol rephase. Really, really good products. I love their lip products as well. And actually, they asked me to be an ambassador for them. And I was just like, oh my God, absolutely, of course I will be. I do have a discount code, which you can only use on their Indeed Labs website. So I'll leave the details again linked down below for you guys for that. But super, super excited that I'm in a bastard for one of my favorite, favorite brands. I can't believe it. So they gave me the 10 Balm Soothing Cream, which I think is gonna be really good for um, sort of like reactive and sensitive skin days. Um, I got the Isolix Mark II, which again is gonna be so, so good just to sort of recover my eye areas from my mental breakdown. Um, I also picked up the Hydrolauron Moisture Serum because I loved their moisture jelly. Um, and I've also really, I've also been loving their moisture, uh, Hydrolauron Moisture Cream as well. So I kind of wanted some a little bit lightweight um, just to sort of whack that hydration in. And then I've also picked up up a nano blur color corrector in peach i do have another one of these already open and it's just so so good to kind of be that no makeup makeup step and just sort of yeah kind of um fade out like the uneven skin tone a little bit so thank you to indeed Labs for sending those products over and thank you for asking me to be an ambassador for you like that is just uh, incredible and I'm super, super chuffed. Oh my God, there's so much more skincare still left to go. Um, but first of all, actually, I picked up some more Korean skincare which and some more new Korean skincare as well, which I'm so, so excited about. They're currently on their way to me. I don't know where, about on the earth in transit, but I picked up the Dr. Sarah Cole Vegan Kombucha Tea Gel Cream, which you know that I absolutely love their kombucha tea essence. It's just absolutely incredible like that by face product and then they brought out their moisturizer gel cream kind of thing and I was just like that is a bit of me for my combination skin so as soon as that sort of came into a retailer I absolutely picked that up I also picked up the new beauty of your zen glow repair serum with rice bran extract like Oh, that is just a bit of me as well. Um, I did also pick up a few little bits, which I'll show you probably in another haul, um, sort of in a couple of weeks or something like that. But yeah, really excited about those two brand new Korean skincare launches there. Um, and I'm just so excited to do, to do a review on them as well. Um, and also I finally 
picked up some bits from Boots Skincare, which is a UK drugstore here. So the brand PSA, which is Purposeful Skincare by Allies, um, which is a sister brand to Allies of Skin. They actually recently launched in Boots, which I was so, so happy about. And I've been meaning to try them for such a long time now, and they kind of had like an offer on. So if you spend over a certain amount, you get a free product. And I was like, I'm a bit of that, a bit of that. So I picked up the, the Most Serum, which is like a really sort of fantastic humectant, hydration, nutrition, nu nutrient rich um, um, serum. So I've been using this a little bit and it's absolutely incredible. And then also I picked up liquid clarity because hopefully this will just be really great for sort of like kind of eradicating any dark spots on my skin and sort of like congestion on my skin as well. And then with the free products, I actually got a full size light up, which is kind of like a um, flash brightening mask with vitamin C and vitamin E. I think just to sort of improve the radiance and improve sort of like the antioxidant benefits as well. Oh, and also while I was on boots, I obviously picked up one of my favorite sunscreen products, which is the Garnier and Bacillaire Anti-Age Super UV Hyaluronic Acid Cream. Oh. I'm obsessed. So yeah, those are all of the bits I've recently purchased and recently received in PR over the past five to six weeks. And I really do hope um, you've enjoyed this really nice chilled out video of what I've got recently. And yeah, um, it's really nice to be back. And I really do hope you've enjoyed this video. And please don't forget to give it a big massive thumbs up and also subscribe if you're new here. I'd really appreciate it. So. And thank you as well to you for sticking around. I really do appreciate you so, so much. So I'll see you in the next one. See you later. Bye-bye.